Welcome to my channel please subscribe IAT Reference Architecture IAT Reference Architecture is the blueprint or framework that describes the various layers of the IAT system and how they interrelate. This architecture helps to guide the design and implementation of IAT solutions. The reference architecture is used to ensure interoperability, reliability, scalability, and security of the IAT system. It is an essential tool for architects and developers who are responsible for designing, building, and deploying IAT solutions. The IAT reference architecture comprises five layers. The first layer is the perception layer, which consists of sensors and devices that gather data from the environment. The second layer is the network layer, which connects the sensors and devices to the cloud or edge computing. The third layer is the service layer, which performs data processing, storage, and analysis. The fourth layer is the application layer, which provides the end users with insights and decision-making tools. The fifth layer is the business layer, which enables the business to monetize the IAT solution. The perception layer is responsible for collecting data from the environment, such as temperature, humidity, pressure, and light. The sensors and devices in this layer may be wired or wireless, and they may communicate using different protocols, such as Bluetooth, ZigBee, and Wi-Fi. The data collected by these sensors and devices is usually raw and needs to be processed and analyzed before it can be useful. The network layer is responsible for connecting the sensors and devices to the cloud or edge computing. This layer may use different network technologies, such as cellular, satellite, or Ethernet. The network layer ensures that the data collected by the sensors and devices is transmitted securely and reliably to the service layer. It also provides the necessary bandwidth and latency requirements for the IAT solution. The service layer is responsible for processing, storing, and analyzing the data collected by the sensors and devices. This layer may use cloud computing or edge computing, depending on the requirements of the IAT solution. The service layer may use different tools and technologies, such as data analytics, machine learning, and artificial intelligence, to extract insights and knowledge from the data. The application layer provides the end users with insights and decision making tools. This layer may use different applications, such as dashboards, reports, and alerts, to visualize the data and provide actionable insights. The application layer may also use different technologies, such as augmented reality, virtual reality, and natural language processing, to interact with the users. The business layer enables the business to monetize the IAT solution. This layer may use different business models, such as subscription, licensing, and paper use, to generate revenue from the IAT solution. The business layer may also use different marketing and sales strategies to promote the IAT solution and attract customers. In conclusion, IAT reference architecture is a crucial tool for designing, building, and deploying IAT solutions. It provides a blueprint or framework for the different layers of the IAT system and how they interrelate. The architecture ensures interoperability, reliability, scalability, and security of the IAT system. Architects and developers must understand the reference architecture and use it to guide their design and implementation of IAT solutions.